What's going on, everybody? 343 Vlogs here in the Nathan 343. Hope you're all having a fantastic day. We have been busy, and I have been super, super busy, and haven't had a video out in a while, but I want to check in with you guys and let you guys know what I've been up to. So, as you can see here, we did a prom at the Holmes Church here in Charleston. This prom was for the special needs and families of the community, and boy, did we have a turnout. We had probably over 100 people. It was great. They loved the show. They loved my setup. Now, the Holmes Church, they made a little recap video, and here's how it goes. The Holmes Church did an awesome job putting this on, and I was so happy to be a part of it. They've actually invited me to do it next year, so, so excited. Then, I DJ'd a birthday party for a few people, and uh, this is how that went. Well, spring has sprung and lawn care season is in Clint, full swing. Alex and me, we're out here. We're doing spring cleanups today. Yeah, finally got some decent weather to clean up gumballs and leaves and get it all cleaned up. We got... After spring cleanups came mowing the grass and we've only mowed our properties twice at the time of this video. Uh, we've had some frost, We've had some cold temperatures at nights down in the uh, mid 20s and uh, a lot of rain, so it's really wet up there. We also got a new mower, at least new to us. Uh, the one I'm using here is new to us this year. I uh, definitely like it. It's definitely got a little more meaner sound to it. The engine sounds good. The exhaust sounds great. It does really good. It's got a wider stance, bigger tires, taller tires, and wider tires, which makes it uh, move across soft, muddy ground a lot better. And then, of course, Miss Elsa. What'd she get for Easter? Elsa has a bunny on her back. What do you think, Elsa? You got a bunny on your back? Now, a lot of you guys probably think that the fire departments that are in your city that are paid fire departments, that they don't do a whole lot other than respond to calls when they come in. Well, what are they doing when those calls are not coming in? Well, as you can see here, they're testing equipment to make sure that it's on its tip-top shape and ready to deploy at a moment's notice. So when the phone rings and you've got a problem and you need help, they're ready to respond at a moment's notice. Here we see a couple of Charleston firefighters testing out the ladder truck, making sure that it will deploy all the way at 109 feet to its highest position. And uh, this truck doesn't go out a whole lot. Uh, it goes out on activated fire alarms, and uh, the less it's out, that means the less property that's getting destroyed. So they did a complete rotate, complete, uh, the turntable completely rotated around the uh, turnhouse, and uh, they brought it on back down and put it back in its uh, cradle. 
So it was good to see getting the ladder truck tested and ready to make sure that it's ready to go if it is needed. LEDs. Uh, we are checking out some new LED lights. We're going to go into four wheeler. So let's get these open. I've already opened one. I've actually got one installed. Kind of want to double check here, but this is how they are. They're a three triple deal, then it's got lights there on the end. And it's got one of those type of uh, deals where it only goes in one way. So you can't mess it up. I'm gonna go ahead and install it. Show you what you look like. Well, those those are pretty nice. They light up a lot more than it used to, <laughs> and it's less power draw on the battery. How about that? So uh, I still am gonna get a, a light bar, about a 22 incher, and put right up here on the front and hook that up to a switch somehow. So yeah, of course I got my bright old tail light back here, I probably need switch wires because it's set like as if I'm hitting my brake. It's pretty bright. So, yeah, might be going riding this weekend. We'll see. We got Clint's wheeler and there's Carter's over there and another one in there. So yeah, got, got some decent headlights, I guess. I can see a little bit better. So, we'll, uh, we'll see how it goes. But, uh, yeah, I'll leave the link to these uh, LED lights uh, in the description. They're they're decent. Are they on bright? Are those on dims? I don't even remember. Let's find out. Um, nope, those are. I ain't switching between them now. It's just one. <laughs> Weird. Should be dims, and then. Brights. Now they're just staying brights. Mm, awkward. Oh well. <laughs> they're stuck on brights. Guess that's the way I'd like to have them. So it's probably because they're LED. It's not recognizing it. So yeah, uh, I'm gonna be changing oil on this booger. Uh, getting a light bar for it. Uh, mounting it up front there. Hopefully, maybe riding this in the parade. Uh, sometime this summer, I'm gonna get it all prey worthy and uh, cleaned up. Like I say, we got the rock lights. I'd like to go riding in a couple night parades, so get some flags on up in there and kind of advertise for New Horizon and DJ Fire and all that good stuff. So, yeah. 